Painting hand here. Today I'm going to share with you how to paint these beautiful uh, dreamy watercolor peonies. They are beautiful and gorgeous flowers, but they are not, they are not easy to paint, right? This is my reference photo that we are going to use to draw the peonies. And this uh, peony Peony pedals have a very complicated, so I'm going to modify this reference photo to simplify the peonies. So I'm going to these peonies a little bit big, so I remove this peony and then a little bit simple modified peony I'm going to put here. So this main, main flower and second flower is smaller than this flower so one more peony put in here okay I'm going to uh, paint in detail only uh, this main flower and other flowers I'm going to make a little bit blurry let's start to sketch on the paper with the 2H pencil oh okay uh, colors um, I'm going to use these colors for flower. Um, so this color name is Pirol Lubin in Brilliant Pink. This one is for flower. And Zeppelin Ultramarine Deep for leaf. And this uh, Emerald Green Nova for background some uh, area. Okay. And brushes. Hong brush, Escoda, two of a brush, and Da Vinci brush. Okay, paper is Archie Cold Pressed 140 pound paper. So, okay, first I'm going to start uh, sketchy with the 2H pencil. So, start. Okay, Sherry, start. Okay, I decided place my peony here. So first, uh, this one is main flowers, so I'm going to draw a little bit bigger. First, a big oval shape here. And another small oval shape. Put in center. Okay. And leaves, petals. Okay, that's it. Okay, next we are going to start coloring. Okay. First, I'm going to uh, wet on wet technique for background and inside uh, or no flowers. So I'm going to first wet the paper, whole entire paper, uh, except these flowers. So I, I want, I want to save this. Uh, main flower only main flowers okay This, this is uh, brilliant pink. First, I'm going to put on the flower area. Next, I'm going to uh, background the colors. So, I I'm gonna use this 
에메랄드 그린 Not much, just a few area, small area. Okay. This uh, paper uh, holds a lot of water, so after dry, this color will be very little bit lighter than now. I'm going to put some shadow area before this paper dry. So I, I got some ultramarine deep mix, brilliant pink. These peony petals, they have stopped together. So this little bit open space, color a little bit dark and they are, they have some shadow area. So I put ultramarine deep mix, brilliant pink color kind of shadow okay okay this light is coming from left to upper side so this area is a little bit lighter this area is uh, shadow area and I got some uh, sap green mix Sap green mix, ultramarine deep for leaves, peonies leaves area. Of course, this is uh, first layer. Now I'm wetting the uh, pedal. I have to say this uh, some highlight area, highlight area and highlight area will be very lightest color there. So I didn't wet paint. I didn't uh, apply the water just to save white space, white area, okay? Here and here, here. I uh, put on the pedal brilliant pink color, uh, very little bit thick color. So I dilute that color with clean water. So I uh, made. I want to make the smooth pedal colors. Okay, inside uh, Here is the center of the uh, flower so They have 
there are small holes like uh, some of uh, bowl or cups. Did you ever paint these peonies? Any materials, any supplies? Yeah, why don't you try? I painted a lot of times with peony, um, oil and pastel, watercolor, yeah. But I my feel every single time I enjoy this, this time, but uh, I feel very uh, difficult. <laughs> peonies cause peony petals so complicated. But yeah, after finish this peony, uh, make a good uh, energy, good energy. I got from this peony so I want to peonies paint again 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 and just a touchy peony original color yeah they spread the color because this paper wet When I'm doing a uh, painting, when I'm doing watercolor, I really enjoyed this pro process. First wet paper and touchy, little dark color, they spread each other. You can do uh, like that. First, draw with a dark, thick color, and then with the clean water, dilute the this color like that. Leaf color, get some zap green mix, ultramarine deep. I want to get very strong, thick color. So I'm going to put here. the needs flower usually very dark
you remember here is a small pass okay I want to save that part here on the watch okay I'm going to remove these parts okay let me show you how i fix some area i don't like this area too dark uh, before i uh, applied this uh, some buds yeah i didn't keep it but this one is too much dark it do doesn't have any air so i i want to make a little bit uh, this foreground area make a little bit lighter so if you have any uh, spread spread butter mm, you can you can use it but i don't have any spreads in my studio so i'm going to use this uh, background brush so just to, i'm going to put some water in here We can take out some colors. Okay. And then can you show it this area? Okay. And I mean I wanna mix this some flower color here. Okay, and I'm going to use one more time spreader technique on here. Okay, enough.
Okay, I have done this painting. Thank you for watching this painting. See you next time. Bye.